Okay, here we are talking about whether or not we have a function. Somebody will hand us a relation and ask, is it a function? So, for example, here we have this relation f. The question is, does every input have exactly one output? Here are my inputs, my domain. Does every one of these have exactly one line coming off of it? Yes. Now, two different inputs have the same output. We don't care about that. Every input, the input 1, has an output of 2 every single time. The input 3 has exactly one output. Happens to also be 2. Don't care. Is f a function? Yes. f is a function. Okay, let's look at another example. Is g a function? Does every input have exactly one output? No, the input 7 sometimes is 1, sometimes is 3. We have two lines coming off 7. This input has two different outputs. G is not a function. Okay, what if somebody hands us a table? Does this xy table represent a function? Does every x correspond with exactly one y? And the answer is yes. Now, two different x's, 1, and 2 both have the same output, but we don't care what's happening over here. We only care, are there any repeated x's with different y's? No problems here. This relation is a function. What about over here? Do we have any repeated x's? Yes. The input 2 has two different outputs. Now, if these had been the same output, if these were both 1, we wouldn't have a problem. It's the fact that the input 2 has two different outputs. This is not a function. Okay, what if somebody hands us a graph? How do we tell if we have a function? Well, then we use the vertical line test. We imagine every possible vertical line passing through our graph if we can find a single vertical line that hits the graph more than once, we don't have a function. So imagine, say, for example, this vertical line right here. That hit my graph once, right there. This vertical line hit the graph once, right here. Every possible vertical line I could draw would hit the graph at most once. This vertical line doesn't hit the graph at all. But that's okay. No vertical line hits the graph more than once. This does represent a function. In this picture, does this graph represent a function? No. This vertical line, for example, there's one of them that's bad, hits the graph twice. This is not a function. Same in this picture down here. Does this circle represent a function? No. This vertical line Right here, for example, hits the graph more than once, not a function. Okay, and finally, does this graph, this is absolute value of x, by the way, does this represent a function? Yes. Every possible vertical line you could draw will hit the graph at most once. I'm drawing a bunch of vertical lines here. Every one of them will hit the graph, in this case, exactly once. This is a function.